participating in the community helps me personally in a number of ways. Uh, one of the key things is I have my alerts that every time I, I post in the forum uh, and pr propose an answer to someone, I get an email you know, that comes back and says, a comment has been made. What I love to see is your answer has been accepted. And then the positive recognition of the feedback from the individual saying, hey, I spent hours on that. You saved me a ton of work. Thank you. Or, you know, thanks for the detailed explanation. Uh, you know, there's a lot of emails in the day that you have to go through and muddle through. But when you get to see those kind of emails, it brightens your day uh, and really kind of know, help you know that you're making a difference. Uh, you know, helping people to learn this platform and uh, be productive. So one thing that gives me joy about the community is really seeing, I guess, my posts as answers and really seeing that thank you note for these users. I even, especially when I receive some private message to say, I, I've been trying this, I've been having a hard time. Uh, you know, it's been sometimes weeks, right? That users like, I can't get this working. And, and, and yeah, and just to see that, I guess I helped them a bit. And uh, yeah, I think that's very rewarding or, or gives me a lot of joy. It's like a habit now, this community. So when I wake up, the first thing that I do is to check my emails if there's any questions that has been asked. So I just go over the questions from my email and reply the ones that I can. And what is joyful also is to see that verified answer. And of course, every month, I'm just looking at the community newsletter on where I am, <laughs> if I'm in the first top 10 or so. So these three things is like really uh, enjoy of my life. When I give somebody an answer and it's wrong, and then I give them a different answer and it's wrong, and I give them a different answer and they say, that's closer, it's helping, but not quite there. And we work together over several iterations, right? This is somebody who like the problem might take days. It might take days to work through, but eventually we get to that spot and you get that final post from somebody saying, that was it. That got me past my problem. Thank you so much. When you can be part of that, that, <laughs> that process, let's so, let's say just a, somebody who regurgitates an answer, but somebody who really becomes part of the, the process of solving this challenge, that is really rewarding. It's, it's amazing. Um, and it's it's something that really I, I don't get anywhere else other other than you know I mean, working with other coworkers around me sure, but it, it somehow it's even more validating when it's somebody I don't know that I can really help them get past something that otherwise would have stopped them dead. I just decided that after years of wanting to be involved in the forums, I thought last year you know what I'm going to get stuck in. I want to go and validate my knowledge, and I want to help other people. That that was my primary goal. And that's my goal that I continue to want to achieve. I just want to go and help other people. There's all these newfangled tools and everything's changed at the moment, but there's still people on the ground with real life problems that need helping now. Like this bit of code doesn't work, I need your help. So first and foremost, I just want to help people. I think the more people you help, a super user and other wards and, and a claim just kind of just kind of come with it, don't they? Um, but I never really necessarily had the goal to be a super user. Um, my goal is just to help as many people as possible and you know I'm lucky enough to be recognized for, for those contributions. But the most important uh, uh, things in the Microsoft community that uh, makes me happy to work with is that uh, I have uh, this possibility to learn and uh, develop my expertise. And at the same time, I have this possibility to share my knowledge and expertise to the others. I've got a bit of time on my hands. I'm semi-retired. Um, and uh, I, I feel if I, if I jump up there and spend a couple of hours helping people, you know, I get to, to sit here and, and, and converse with people and um, they get uh, hopefully some help.